Welcome to the channel, everybody. My name is Ryan, and we are playing Stardew Valley today. Good morning. Here we are in our little Riverland cottage. So you can see we've got the uh, the fun little anchor there. It definitely has a nice Riverland feel. They got the portholes instead of windows. That's pretty cool. Let's uh, let's get into it. Let's check the weather here. Hit that like button for me, guys. Tell me in the comments, are you playing along? Are you doing your own Stardew Valley run? Let me know. All right, so what do we got? Oh, also, are you pumped for the new game? I've heard little rumors about it, but there is a new one coming out from the developer. Welcome to the Oracle. Da, 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 da. The spirits are somewhat mildly the perturbed. Luck is not on our side. Let's see what living off the land has to say. Okay, find a whole bush. Um, pretty straightforward stuff. You can sometimes find a whole bunch growing right out of the dirt. Oh, the spring onions. Yes, yes. I didn't see the weather report. Rain all day tomorrow. Okay, that's good to know. Let's get into it. Let's go check on the farm. Now we've got mainly cauliflower out here, but ooh, look, we've got a little bit of money. That's right. Uh, we're one person away from our introductions and we need to get some parsnips. So two of these are parsnips. I believe it's these two right here. But uh, anyway, let's see what we got going on. We got a little bit of time to kill, so I'm gonna go ahead and get everything watered up don't doesn't take but a moment here and like i said we do have mostly cauliflower but there, there's some mixed seeds in here too that we've uh, collected along the way man i am so pumped to play again it's been a couple years so i'm sure some stuff has changed quite a bit but uh, let's see here so we just refilled that let's go ahead and uh, start moving towards the uh the shop because i can do a little bit of foraging out here oh speaking of which whoops uh, we've got ourselves some, what is this, leeks? Delicious leeks. Yum, yum. All right, just checking up here. Very good. The bus doesn't work. The uh, the little mine cart doesn't work yet, unfortunately, but we'll get all that settled. No worries, no worries. Okay, now we, it's Thursday the 4th, so we got to remember that uh, Mayor Lewis's birthday is on Sunday. Let's check in. See, oh, okay, it's Vincent's after that, so his is next Wednesday. We, uh, I should start trying to give some presents out. Oh, a little bit early, a little bit early. Let's make sure nobody's watching us. We'll check the trash. Uh, but yeah, I don't have everyone's favorite gifts memorized, but I do have several. Let's just pop down here. I think we'll still get a little bit of, uh, What's a reputation? Not reputation, just a faction if we go and talk to them, regardless of giving them a gift or not. <clears throat> Nobody's wi willing to talk to me till 9 a.m. Oh no. Ah, here's Penny. Hi, Penny. We'll talk to her. There we go. All right. So I think it's time to head up to the shop, and I'm pretty much just going to buy all cauliflower, I think. But uh, who knows? Oh, hey, let's talk to her real quick. What's her name? Maru. That's right. We can, all right, good to go. Now, let's see, how much is the bag again? Two grand, 2,000. Not now, we will get there though. All right, so cauliflower seeds. With all the cauliflower we've grown, we might actually get there soon on our first or second harvest, possibly. All right, so that's good enough. We've got 76 gold left. Um, potatoes, let's see, take six days, multiple yields. Do these go in spring and summer? No, just at spring. Okay. I want to get something possibly that will cross over, but it's still fairly early in the year now, so that's okay. Uh, I say we actually go ahead and get some more parsnips. Believe it or not, never thought I'd say that, but let's just get three of those. Well, we've been pretty lucky. The crows haven't come to our farm yet, so... I'm going to go ahead and get things situated. Let's do three plots for the parsnips there. I'll go ahead and slap those down. And we've got one, two, three, four, and then maybe three more right here. That should be seven. Beautiful. And of course, I think we're going to, what should we do for the rest of the day though? Because this is about all we got going on. Should we go down to the beach and do some fishing? Because then we can sell directly to Willie and stuff. He might enjoy that. We can give him uh, give him at least a present of some fish. I'm sure he'll like it. Uh, that's not a bad idea. Of course, we are here in the Riverlands. So we could do some fishing ourselves in this area. But, um, oh. 
well, that settles it. We're going to head over there because now I can uh, turn in the strange doll. Awesome. Hey, check it out. We got the last one is Elliot. Ah, I was mistaken in the first episode. I thought the uh, wizard was the last guy, but uh, I was wrong. Elliot is the beachcomber. Uh, and we have finished. Very good. Well, awesome. Let's see. So now we've got give someone a gift. That's great. That's great. We can do that. Um, I don't have anything currently, but uh, if we find some flowers, I know where Haley's at. She's up near the park. I saw her going there. Oh boy, the beach is very noisy. Let's see here. Okay, just looking, just looking around, seeing if we got anything going on here. Ah, very nice. We got some little wormy worms. Okay, okay. Of course, we can check on this. 300 pieces of wood. Wait, is that what it said? Yeah, that's not bad. That's not bad at all. Okay, so let's head on down. Ooh, almost missed a seashell. Very good. All right, that's handy. I tell you what, I think I need to calm down the sound of this ocean here real quick okay i think it's a little bit better i just turned the ambient sounds down let's make sure willie's here yep he's there all right it's uh middle of the day but we can definitely do some fish in here oh i just noticed there's some bubbly waters up there i'm gonna have to backtrack and go up there ah we got a hit cool oh 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 now, if you missed the previous episode, we did, of course, when I selected, I got the river farm. So we're going to be doing a lot of fishing on this one. Uh, but I've also leveled up once already. So pretty happy about that. I'd, oh, did it just disappear right in front of my face? It sure did. All right. So I'm definitely trying to push our fishing. Uh, let's see here. I don't see more bubbly bubblies, but we're, we'll, oops. That wasn't a good cast. We'll, we'll do fine without it. Now, I've forgotten. I think the museum, <clears throat> excuse me, uh, closes at 4.30. So I kind of want to pop over there before they do close and turn in this little doll figurine. All right, there we go. Sardine on the menu. Okay, well, I got a couple sardines and whatever this is, the chat or whatever. Uh, no, no. Trying to give him a gift. There we go. Okay, so we just completed the gift uh, journal, which is awesome. 100 gold. Nice. Now I am going to go ahead and sell him the rest of these. Yeah, we'll sell the clam too. Why not? Very cool. 243. Boy, oh boy, if I'm super fast, I might be able to uh, go buy some more seeds. But then again, I am trying to get, uh, you know, over there to the museum. So let's see if we can't speed run this. I wish I had my horsey with me, then I'd have full confidence, but uh, we might not make it. We'll see. So first the museum, then we'll go by the store. All right. So we've actually got two things here, the little starfish thingy and that guy. Okay. No rewards yet, but that's okay. Let's just go on to the store. See if we can't make it. Oh no, I don't know if we can get in there. Yes. Okay. So I think they close at 430, right? Must be. Let's see here. Awesome. We can get some more cauliflower. Delicious. Delicious. Who doesn't like good spring cauliflower? Let's go ahead and say hello. Oh, I think we've already spoken to Emily. Say hi to Ab Abigail. Abigail's mom, Caroline. Okay. And now we're headed back to the farm. Should we go down south here? Maybe. Yeah, let's do that. I like to come in from the southern entrance. You know, it allows me to kind of collect some resources as I go along here. But uh, we've got a fairly clear path. Um, if I want, I can spend a little time clearing things out, but I do want to go ahead and get this cauliflower in the ground real fast before I spend time clearing. After that, it's really a toss up. Should we fish some more or should I actually cut down a bunch more wood? Cause we could use a lot of wood, you know? There's no harm in actually just cutting some of the trees down on the village. Or, not the village, in the farm. That's always a good thing. Okay, we only got three, but that's still, that's going to be worth something. Oh, yeah. Hmm. Well, probably woodcutter is the better option. Because I'd love to get some more recipes, like um, the pickling thing and the, uh, the brewing. Oh, boy, I can't remember. Yeah, we want the kegs and the brewing barrels. Those are really great. Really great for increasing the value of your produce and stuff. So, all right, let me cut down a few trees. It's pretty late, but I've got a half a bar of energy. So I should be able to fell at least four or five of these babies. 
Okay, well, I've cleared out about four trees or so. I do have a hundred, almost exactly a hundred and fifty wood. Uh, no, that's the wrong one. This is the one we want. Yep. Um, where am I putting my seaweed? Actually, I think I will put the seaweed in here. Yeah, we got it right next to the old uh, algae. Very good. Anyway, so I'm going to have to build a box just for fish stuff like that. But um, I want to maybe build three more chests right now, in fact. So let's go ahead because we're going to need a ton of them. Three. Boom. Now, let's put that one little piece away. Very good. Oh, also, we can take this to the blacksmith at any time. I believe it does cost money, though, so I'm going to wait a little while on that. Maybe especially till we get, like, a few more of them. So we're not just going there with one. So this is good. I think it's okay to cover up the step right here. I'll be able to get in still. Uh, no big deal. But um, let's see. Can I cut down one more tree? It's pos It might be possible. It might be. Let's just try it. No extraneous swings. Let's just go. Here we do. Maybe the stump too. Oh, I don't know. It's oh oh. We're starting to feel exhausted. All right, we'll save the stump for the morning. Stumps in the morning. Although I can swing this a little bit. <laughs> I'm just obsessed with working. It's so dark out here, but I've got to keep going. Uh, I'm so happy to be back in the valley, back in Stardew. All right, there we go. Uh, hopefully, we'll get the scarecrow soon. Because I don't want the, the crow taking any of these crops here. Do not touch my parsnips, crow. I've got a mission. I've got a quest for those, okay? And here we are. Good morning. I believe this is the third day? I can't remember. But, uh, oh, it's Friday the 5th here. It is raining. Let's see what it's going to be like tomorrow. Forecast for tomorrow. Clear and sunny. Okay, that's good to hear. Although we'll need our watering can tomorrow, but right now I can probably put it away. Oh, I didn't check the luck. Not so important, really, unless I think we're going to the mines. Um, I think it might affect other things. I know it definitely has an effect when you go to the mines, but let me know in the comments. What else does luck affect? Oh, this is the JoJo Cola. So we're responsible for anything. Okay, let's see here. We don't like the JoJo Cola people. I've never actually done the JoJo ending, though, where you, like, I think you give them the rights to the community center or something like that. I can't remember. Maybe I'll have to do that. <laughs> I don't know. Anyway, boom, we just got our journal updated. We've completed the quest, our first three uh, crops that we've done on our very own farm. It is a celebration, folks. There we go. Let's do it. Advancing. Awesome. Build a coop. 100 gold. All right, coop's kind of, that one's going to take a little while, but I'll definitely be building a coop. I'll uh, reach level one in farming and craft a scarecrow. You better believe it. Now, we did not level up in anything yesterday, but that's okay. Not the end of the world. Let me go ahead and throw my can in here. And should we, what should we do with the parsnips? I'll just, I'll hold on to them for right now. But, um, yeah, I'm trying, to, I'm trying to build a stockpile of the various different spring stuff because I know eventually I'll need them. But I am tempted to go ahead and sell it just because I want to get as much stuff in the ground as, you know, as I possibly can. So, tell you what, how about I just, I don't need to travel to the beach. I've got my river right here. It's great. I'm going to do some fishing. And if possible, I'll sell a bunch of these fish and, you know, maybe we can buy some seeds then. All right, well, I've been doing okay, catching a bunch of smallmouth bass. I think I'm going to head down to the old beach and sell these off to Willie, and then maybe just do some fishing there. Oh, get out of my way. Okay, there we go. Good, good, good. Yeah, let's take a little stroll in the rain. I think that'll be fun. And if we're quick about it, maybe we can go and get some seeds. Actually, maybe I should just go instead of rushing. That way I can go back home and just continue to fish in the uh, in the river by the farm. Or in the Yeah, that'll work. That'll work. I think that's probably a smarter plan. That way I have the maximum amount of time to spend fishing. Okay, here's old Willie. What you got for me, buddy? Sell these here. Beautiful. Oh, man, we can almost afford the next level of pole. It's not, wait, is that what we already have? Yeah, well, he's got a training pole. Oh, only catches basic fish. I've never seen that before. So this is just a replacement for ours, I guess, if we lose it or something. 
and he's got a Fisher double bed worth $25,000. Willie, what's wrong? Are you crazy? Have you lost your mind, sir? I can't buy it. Willie, why are you overcharging for that bed? I know it's not worth that much. Anyway, all right, off to the store, then back to the farm to, uh, I think, fish in the in the river. It's not important where we're fishing now. It doesn't make a difference. We're not trying to go for any of the records or anything like that or catch them for uh, the community center. Right now, we're just having some fun, trying to level it up and make some money. So most importantly, let's get these seeds in the ground. <gasps> Largemouth bass for Willie, or for Evelyn. I don't know if I can get that. Honestly, Evelyn, that's probably too much of a challenge for me right now. They're basic, basic level. Thanks for the quest, though. All right, let's see here. Um, yeah, all cauliflower. I don't even know what I was thinking. Okay, here's the beautiful farm once again. Now, let's put some of our stuff away. Actually, you know what? Hold on, I want to move some stuff around. So... I think I'll make this one here and the end is going to be my fish chest, my fishing chest. Secondly, I can get rid of the garbage. Let's just get rid of that. Yep, don't need that. Okay, so that's good. Now, I want to go ahead and grab the fish stuff I've got here. Just some algae. Okay, good, good, good. Easier for me to remember when it's on the end like this. Now, if we want, we can actually start saving some of the fish we catch. You know, I, I don't think I will at this early stage. Like I said, mostly we're doing this just for the money and leveling up. But um, hmm. where should I put my cauliflower? How about right there? Boom, boom. Yeah, once we start opening up like cooking recipes and stuff, yeah, then I'll worry about saving some fish. But right now it's not so important. I want to find a nice good spot to fish other than right there. I mean, I'm sure it really doesn't matter. But oh, here we go. This is perfect. We've got ourselves a nice little dock. Let's see what we can catch here. I've been almost exclusively catching smallmouth bass and a couple shads, but um, maybe we'll get lucky get something different. Although we did get the one hit in the first episode that was like really crazy. So I don't know what that was, but uh, obviously we didn't get it. It was a little too challenging for me. Oh, oh just, uh, just some trash for now. Keep trying though. Okay, well, check it out. We are actually doing pretty well. I just got my first bream, I think. Or maybe I've caught one already, but doesn't matter. We're getting a good variety of stuff. Uh, it's a little too late to go and sell it to Willie. And I still have some energy left, so I think I'm going to keep the fishing up. Although I should probably go drop them off in the bin or something, because I've run out of inventory space pretty quickly, as you can see. Also, I don't really need the watering can, but I brought it along for some reason. Hey, there's some bubbles right there, but I guarantee if I tried to run over there right now, it'd probably disappear by the time I got there. Let's see. Can I get a cast off? Oh, it's still there. Oh, no, it disappeared right before I cast my... What did I tell you? Oh, I knew it would happen. Maybe there's something there still floating around. Give, have mercy on us. Give us something. Come on. Is this a perfect? Yay. All right. What did we get? All right. Let's. Oh, yeah. I was going to say we need to go ahead and take this stuff home. Because I'm, uh, I'm having to waste my trash. Those broken CDs are actually decent once you get the a little trash converter. Those will turn into crystal. Yeah. Crystals or whatever. Crystallized something. They turn into something valuable. Worth crafting. All right, yeah, I'm not going to save any fish right now. It's just all going in the bucket. Let's see here. And I've got enough energy left to probably cut down some trees. So I'm not going to let any of that go to waste. I am going to, I mean, unless it gets to be, what is it, 2 a.m.? Is that when the actual cutoff is? When you, like, fall, as, like, just pass out and you end up in the hospital, basically. Uh, so I've got plenty of time, I think, to go ahead and get some of this cleared out. Oh, and I can get the stump that I left from last night, right? Yeah, perfect. All right, well, I am starting to feel exhausted. You know what that means? It is time for bed, folks. Let's put everything away. Very good. I like having all this stuff in here so I can just throw it all in there, including the seeds. Makes it super easy. All right, still only have the one geode, so I'm not too worried about that. But uh, it's time for bed. So you guys, actually, let's let's do this one together to see if we level up. Yeah, there it is, fishing. Oh, crafting recipe, awesome, awesome, very cool. I don't think our 
pole can accommodate any bait, but uh, ooh, we made a decent amount of money. I think it's far too early to expect any cauliflower to be grown, but I'm still hoping. I can still hope against hope, right? Okay, well, we don't have the rooster yet, but somehow the, it's still making noises out there. All right, let's let's uh, let's check our cauliflower. No, nothing yet. Oh, we got another parsnip, though. Beautiful. So I'm going to have to spend a moment or two watering real quick. No big deal. Let's get that done. Oh, boy. Well, we're all finished there. It's going to be so nice once we get some uh, sprinklers up and running. Toss that in there for now because I don't need it. Also, let's put this away. Boop, boop, boop. Now, what should we do today? I'm actually tempted to go ahead. I know I said I wanted to wait till I have more of these, but we only got the one. So let's just take it over there. Maybe we can uh, do a little bit of um, foraging too along the way. We'll see. Always checking up here. Oh, you know what I am going to do? I'm going to cut these trees down. It's extra wood and they will grow back eventually but this is kind of nice it makes also foraging a little bit easier because i can see through here much more easily and we can kind of just if there is something here up here i can just boom zip right through don't have to worry about dodging tree stumps and stuff so let me clear these out all right looks good to me let's go all right, i've got a Almost a full inventory now, though, but uh, don't worry. I think in no time we're going to have $2,000 worth of stuff, so we should be good. I don't think I... Oh, oh, here we go. Awesome. The Pelican Town Community Center. We're going to have to go up here, too, now. Yes. All right, I'm just going to skip this. Yep, we're going up there right away, in fact. Um, the geode can wait. Let's see. Rat problem. Yep, let's take care of that rat problem. We know it's not rats. It's something else. Jujumons. I don't know what they're called, but they're something. Something magical. Okay, here we go. Have those bushes grown back? No, not yet. Probably not till next season. Okay, so I think it's over here we encounter them. Yeah, down in this little room. Beautiful. Oh, get back here, you. Get back here. Do I need to go to each one or no? No, I think it's just that one. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. So we went in, we checked on it. Um, so yeah, that, that advanced it right there. I think just coming into this place advances it. So we're good to go. All right, time to head out and let's go to the blacksmith. Oh, wait a second. There's a little bubblies here. I couldn't resist. I have to fish the bubbles. <gasps> I'll take that all day long. Whoa, that was way over. No, that was perfect. Give me some bubbles. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. All right. We get us some fish real quick. Then we'll do this thing. Oh, man, I was so close to a perfect. All right. That's actually going to fill me up. So let's just go do this. I miss you bubbles already. I wish I could stop and play with the bubbles more, but uh, we got to go. We got to turn this in for science. The blacksmith is, is really expecting this. All right. Let's do it. Who knows? We might get something for the museum too. Let's check it out. Process the geode, sir. Yeah, 25 gold. Um, Yeah, actually, we can turn that in, can't we? Because I think the first one... Yep, Gunther will tell us about this. So the first one of these like little resources is always good to donate. So bada boom. We've got ourselves something. Hold your horses. What's in the trash? Nothing. Nothing yet. We'll get a meal out of there eventually. All right, let's donate our earth crystal... I don't put any rhyme or reason into designing this. I just slap them down wherever, you know? It's like, whatever. Don't matter. All right, still no rewards, man. This Gunther guy, he's kind of stingy. Some people tell me he's kind of stingy, and I would agree. Oh, no, I just came down here to the beach to uh, do some fishing and sell some stuff to Willie, but he's not even here, so now my inventory's full, and I have to go home. Willie, come on, buddy. Quit being lazy. Get back to the store. Well, you know what? We've still got some money left after processing that geode. So I think it's time we buy some cauliflower seeds. Let's get it. Yes, yes, yes. Although I do think the bean is probably about ready to start sprouting, the one we bought back home. So that'll be good. Um, oh, you know what? We can buy a potato. Let's just do it. Let's just do it. All right, perfect. That's uh, We're going to be doing well once these uh, cauliflowers start coming in. I'm probably not going to save most of these. These I'll probably end up selling because that's really going to put us in, put us into some major cashola. 
I love it. All right, now we've still got plenty of time, but my energy is fairly low. I've got to dig up and then water six places. I think we can, pro oh no, five, call that five, because I've already got an extra place down there just for the tater. There you go, tater. All right, let's uh, be careful. Always be careful around other crops when you're doing this. That's three, four, cinco. Okay, let's get those in the ground and get them watered. Where's my pot? Where's my pot water and can? Where? Oh, there it is. Okay, we're good. We got it. I found it. Um, oopsie. Oh, I'm watering something I shouldn't be. Let's put that there, that there. And even if it's just a little bitty bit like this, I still like to go ahead and refill the can for tomorrow. So we're good to go. Now, how much energy do we have? Not a lot, not a lot. We might be hitting the sack pretty early this uh, today, fellas. Oh boy, oh boy, guess what? We've got ourselves another trip to the Gunther, to old stingy Gunther. You know what, I actually kind of want to clear some of the stone out of here, I think. All right, well, yes, I am feeling exhausted already. Um, let's see here, maybe I can eat something. First of all, let me put away Gunther's artifact. Um, you know what, we'll put that in the same box as our can that I normally put that in. Start to start to sort some of this stuff out, you know? There we go. Now I know I could easily make, oh no, I, wait, maybe I can. Do I have the recipe? I'm thinking about the little granola bar thingy. Oh, there it is, field snack, yes, we can make it. Okay, one acorn, one maple seed, and one pine cone. Simple, so, so oh, and I opened the wrong chest. Very simple. Bada boom. All right, let's see here. Get that done. Delicious. And we want to eat that right away. Yes. All right, that's um, <clears throat> not a huge amount of energy for sure, but at least I don't have to go to bed before it turns uh, dark outside. Who doesn't hate that, you know? Who wants to go to bed before it turns dark? Uh, well, <laughs> I started doing a little fishing to conserve energy, and I'm already starting to feel exhausted. My guy's about to pass out if I'm not careful. I am pushing it, but it's still light outside, darn it. That's okay. We're just going to go to bed after this. This is the last cast, I promise. No more. And then we're done. We're just going to toss whatever fish we get. Come on already. I'm tired of stalling. There it is. Oh, well, that's okay. Like I've said previously, I am saving all the algae and seaweed because I know for a fact there's some pretty decent recipes that call for this stuff. So I want to keep as much of that as possible. Also, it would be nice to keep the seeds and stuff, but if I have to, I will use them for the food. Ah, what a respectable little farm we've got. You know, it's a beautiful thing right here, guys. I think we are well on our way to a million dollar farm, if you know what I mean. Uh, even though it's a small start, we are getting there, guys. Thank you so much for joining me for this episode. If you enjoy the Stardew Valley content, hit like, consider subscribing. I really appreciate it. Leave me a comment, and I will see you guys on the next episode.